Hey guys, today I'll be reviewing another Hyundai Kona. This is a 72 plate 2022 model, uh, 150 kilowatt premium. Um, so we've got SE Connects in stock. Pre this is the only premium we got and some Ultimates. Premiums in the middle um, of the trim levels. Uh, this one's finished in galactic grey metallic. Got 17 inch diamond cut alloy standard. Rear privacy. So the premium basically just adds to the SE connecting um, like few features. The privacy glass is one. You get a camera standard on all trims. This has got the double ended fast charging Hyundai cable and a three pin cable, which it also gets standard. This thing's a bit fiddly though, the polystyrene. It's be quite fiddly. Got full black and grey cloth interior two cup holders in the middle, electric rear windows, satin grey trim, keyless entry, two-way electrically adjustable driver's lumbar, you've got a crow audio system with seven speakers and a subwoofer as well, adaptive cruise control stand with steering assist, so essentially the premium just adds to the SE Connect by giving you electric folding mirrors, blind spot assist, lane keeping, uh, privacy glass, and also heated front seat with heated steering wheel. And also a wireless phone charger, and also uh, adaptive LED headlights. You've got 10.25 inch touchscreen with Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, navigation and Bluetooth. Uh, this is a 150 kilowatt premium. So it's showing 289 miles. So if we put it in a Eco, yeah, 295. Wow, uh, that's pretty good actually. They're rated for 280. So, premium can be the SE only has a small battery, Ultimates only have a big, and premiums can have a small 100 kilowatt or 150 kilowatt long range. So, this has got the Ultimates battery, uh, it's showing 289 miles. They're rated for 280. So, that's actually really good. Sometimes, if you get less than that, it's you know, it's just depending on how you drive, you'll get even better than that if you drive. Uh, more and more um so yeah it's quite nice 150 kilowatt is 203 brake horsepower so these are slightly like have a bit more of a cost premium than the small batteries as you've got do have that enlarging capacity and more brake horsepower you've got adaptive led headlights with uh, led drls and on bottom here you've got full adaptive led main beam headlights that which the se connects don't get these are the ultimates headlights Overall quite nice, obviously if you're looking for something lower price range but you kind of want some stuff on it like heated seats, I think heated seats is a bit of a must, but you know it's personal preference depending on who you are really, just what you want. So yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one.